Well, first, just to finish off the ballet, I, the idea was to shoot here with the ballerinas, with the fashion model, because we have um, Nikita, the ballet master, with us, and we also have the prima ballerinas, but then we have our interloper, the great Denisa, who is not pretending to be one of the ballerinas, but kind of playing the role of the prima ballerina, or at least the prima donna. assisting Olga on this shoot it was 950 items in total um, clothes jewelry and shoes um, yeah it's been it was an experience getting through customs but it's nice to finally be here and uh, to see everything and put it all together representation of the process here. We took a picture in the costume room and now we just took a picture in the rehearsal space. to work here and we got to eat caviar and bellini every night thank you nice to be here 
Here are some of our reference photos that we're using for inspiration. To do a shoot like this, we have to do we have to do some research. So the next picture, no, the next picture, where is that picture? Yeah, so this is a picture of Balanchine, George Balanchine, who was a great Russian choreographer. So the next picture we're going to do is kind of a imitation of this, except with our Denisa and with Nikita. Two, three. Part of this, this shoot is obviously we're using the theatre and the ballet as a backdrop to create this kind of fashion story. So it's about the contrast between the classic and the kind of modern day fashion and the, the fusion between the two. Let me actually pull, you're going to have to help me organize this. Down here. Yeah, you're going to be my choreographer on, in the field. Now turn around and do that again. <laughs> okay. 